Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So earlier this week, as I posted, Microsoft rolled out their latest stable release of Microsoft Edge version 123.0.2420.53. Now that video will be uh, linked in the end screen. But just to clear up a little bit of confusion, because I have seen in the comments and also there are some reports doing the rounds online, that Microsoft has pulled version 123. Now, there basically are two sides to the story because initially um, it was thought, and as I posted, that um, Microsoft pulled the update because, as I mentioned in a previous video, which will also be in the end screen, it was thought that Microsoft had accidentally rolled out this little Copilot app, Microsoft Copilot, to all users. And that was basically an accident and wasn't supposed to happen because there is no Copilot app in the Microsoft Store. And that's why they pulled the, the rollout of um, Edge version 123. Now, that was originally more or less what the, 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 thought, the thought process was and reports were saying online. But it seems now that that was not the case. This is all supposed to happen, but go check the video out in the end screen if you want more information regarding Edge 123 installing this little Microsoft Copilot app, which is approximately 8 kilobytes in size. Now, the official statement from Microsoft, um, they say the rollout, and I'm quoting, for Microsoft Edge 123 was paused to ensure compatibility with certain enterprise configurations related to storage of user profile data. It was not related to Microsoft Copilot. We plan to resume the rollout of Edge 123 as soon as March 27, 2024, which is today. So today is the 27th of March in my region. So later today in my region, if you haven't received Edge version 123 yet, you should start seeing that on your device. So that's more or less what has happened. It had nothing to do with this Copilot, uh, the Copilot app as mentioned. It's all to do with uh, certain enterprise configurations related to storage of user profile data. And that's the official update. And that's the official response now um, from Microsoft. And um, as mentioned, I have seen one or two comments where users were asking, where's 123? It hasn't arrived in this region or that region. And this is now the reason why. And uh, um, obviously, if I get any more info regarding this, then I will post and keep you guys in the loop. But that's the latest. And if you haven't installed Edge version 123, your latest version, until that does roll out later today on the 27th of March, should be version 122.0.2365.92. So I hope this just clears up a little bit of confusion. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.